Hello everyone, uh, my name is Martin Medeiros. I'll be your instructor for Econ 1 Microeconomics for the summer. And I just wanted to take this time to kind of show you how this class is going to be structured on a week-to-week -week basis. Now this is a summer course, and I know summer courses are on an accelerated schedule, so we're going to be covering a lot of material in a short period of time. Um, so I want you to know what to expect on a week-to-week -week basis. So what I want to do right away is kind of scroll down. I'm, on, I'm, I'm looking at the course syllabus, and the course syllabus can be found on the Canvas site, which I'm going to be accessing in a second. I want to scroll down to the course schedule. And what I've done here is I've listed everything by week and the chapters we're going to be covering. Now we have class two times a week, so you can see the class dates are scheduled here. And I've all listed I've also listed the exams when they'll be happening. So for our we have two midterms, and one midterm is going to be on the 27th, and the other midterm is going to be on the 11th of July, and the final exam is going to be on August 1st. But let's take week one, for example. So what would you expect on a week-to-week -week basis? Well, if I scroll up, you can see that we have online quizzes for homework, and we have discussion threads, and something called video questions. And let me go to what we see here. So this is your uh, the class site. And here I post, this is where I posted the video and I have my information and how to contact me via email and some resources that we have at Chabot as well as the syllabus that I just accessed. Now, excuse me, a street cleaner is going by here. Let's look at week one. Now, week one, I give you a to-do list and I explain to you that you need to read the chapters watch the recorded lectures, and then compete the activities by Sunday. So everything is due on Sunday. So, for example, for our class, um, the first due date is going to be June 17th, which is a Sunday. And so the question is, what's, what is due? Well, let me go back to the course home. And let's look at week one. Now, I tell you what you have to do for reading. I have reading assignment chapters one through two. And what I've done here is I've recorded lectures for chapter one. And then I have posted my uh, lecture slides that I'll be using in class. Now, I haven't posted my lecture, uh, recorded my lectures for uh, chapter two, but I have posted my uh, PowerPoint slides. So step one is to do the reading and watch my video lectures preferably before class starts. Then after you've come to class, you've watched the, uh, you've uh, listened to the lecture and you've read the material, um, you are to answer these video questions. Now a video question, let me click on one, is basically, let me take the quiz. Basically you have to watch a video and answer only one question on that video for, for points. Now, each individual video question is not worth that much, but in total, they're a part of your grade, which can be significant. So that's now I, I did not leave, I did not make these questions tricky. All you've got to do is watch the videos closely, and you should you should be able to answer them uh, nicely. Now, these videos complement your reading, and they're going to help you with the quiz. The quiz, there's usually a quiz for every chapter, and, they, and there's 10 questions per quiz. So if I click on this, I click on tick the questions. Now, as you can see, there's no time limit. All you've got to do is finish this quiz before the due date. See the due date? That's Sunday at midnight. And the same thing goes with those video questions. So everything is due on Sunday. Um, and you take the quiz, and you could um, start and stop it and, and answer your questions. And when Sunday rolls around, it, the system is going to take your last saved attempt and you'll be graded accordingly. Uh, now, one thing that we don't have in week one is a discussion thread. 
I put a discussion forum uh, every other week. I have that for week two, but that's also going to be due on uh, Sunday. So basically come to class, uh, hopefully done the reading before class, watch these videos before class. Then you attempt the video questions, quiz, and discussion thread. And that's basically how things work every single week. Now the, the exams will be in class. So the midterm, the two midterms and the final exam will be in class, but the rest of the testing is going to be done through Canvas. Um, so if you have any questions, you could talk to me before class or you could uh, email me. So all of the course materials that you need are going to be located in the syllabus in terms of the textbook. And I think that's about it. So I look forward to seeing you in class. And again, email me if you have any questions.